Welcome back. How you doing? Starting off with a little 2009 Sonoma Harvest. This is the name of the game today. Um, Sonoma Harvest is a blend here at Harvest Moon. It's a what we call a secondary label. It's not that traditional uh, clean um, white backed label of the Harvest Moon. This is our Sonoma Harvest. It's our calf based blend. It's a predominantly um, Bordeaux based blend. Calf, Franc, Merlot. And then I throw a little bit of uh, Syrah, Petite Syrah in there. So uh, it's uh, almost Bordeaux with, with the exception of the Syrah and Petite. I love this wine. This is a um, a wine that inspired me uh, by uh, tasting a lot of big, big uh, cap blends. These Meritages tend to be very high in alcohol, very extracted, and a lot of new, new French oak, uh, which is fine. It's uh, one particular style, but uh, I started making this wine back in 2005, and this blend is um, it's pretty challenging to put together because I'm bringing together six different little vineyards, getting them off the vine at the right time to try and capture this lower alcohol, uh, easier uh, drinking, earlier con consumption type of Sonoma Harvest blend. Um, now this wine will age five to eight years, but it's tasting really nice right now with only about uh, seven months in the bottle. Let's check it out. Immediately that board, that earthy Bordeaux uh, dust, it's not Rutherford dust, but we'll call it dry creek dust. It comes right out of glass. Now this blend is not a berry driven blend, but the varietals that we have in this, um, the earth, the clove, there's a little smokiness to this wine. This wine finished out around 13 to 13.2, so very moderate alcohol. For 2009, it pulls at you a little bit. But it's like a kind of a slow wave that comes and grips you, and then it lets go and goes back. Uh, lovely right now. Uh, this is going out to the wine club, I think, pretty soon. Really classic approach to Bordeaux. Uh, I think uh, I think any French winemaker would be proud. Cheers. Mm. 